I have no idea why the first video got got cut off. I think it was my phone probably tripping, but praise the Lord. Uh, so just long story short, I just wanted to just encourage you guys that, you know, if you find yourself in traffic, you know, um, if you are in, beyond traffic, you find yourself in a place where things aren't going the way that you planned it to go today, you know, to make sure to, to take a moment to stop, breathe, you know, let allow allow God to talk to you and as you talk to him, but allow him to talk to you and open your heart and mind to out to to being to step outside of you in that moment, realizing that the picture is bigger than you. And think about think of take that time to really think about okay, yes, it's not working out the way it should go. Yes, I'm not completely my schedule's a little thrown off, but hey, but I'm still gonna make it to my destination. That's what that's what's important, that's what matters. I may not make it there completely on time, but but what matters most is me making it there safely. You know, uh, whether the, you know delays happen in, in our lives, whether it be in traffic, whether it be, you know, in, in whether it be you're, you're expecting something to come and it's delayed. Many delays happen, but I just want to encourage you today, as God has encouraged my heart and really, really convicted my heart, and, and realizing that, you know, to take that moment, take moments in your life to realize that. You know, don't 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 allow. We gotta we gotta make sure we we're not getting consumed in our own selves, in our own in our own minds. You know, it's, it's very easy to get consumed in yourself and get consumed in your life, and your schedule, your you know your deadlines and things. But you know, there's 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 other lives that are around us that are being affected, and we gotta really make sure that we're not just looking out for ourselves, but and again, as the word says, think of others higher than we think of ourselves. You know, and, and, and if you are kind of traffic, such as, as as Zach and I was today, I encourage you to take that moment to pray. You know, if there even if there's no accident, if there's just random traffic, pray for, you know, take that time to pray to God and just talk to God and praise God and may, may even take that moment to just thank him that, hey, God, I think, thank you for that. Even though I'm in traffic, I'm alive, I'm well, you know, I'm on my, even though I may be delayed and getting to my destination, I, the main thing is, God, I thank you that I'm, thank you for being with me, that I'm going to be able to make it there safely. And, you know, and just or even think, take that moment to pray and ask God to bless the person that the cars that are next to you in traffic. You know, that's what God really began to open my mind to in that in that moment of me beginning to complain in my heart, my mind. You know, when we got caught in that traffic, immediately my, my mind went to complaining, man, God, I wasn't expecting to run into this traffic. I was expecting on just getting having a smooth ride home so we can get home to Rian and, and Harmony and Jaden. And so we can, you know, we can go go throughout the rest of our plans today. But you know what, but God, you know, but hey, it's okay because those plans are still going to happen. It may not, you know, and, and the main, what matters most is that, you know, hey, pray, you know, think about others before you, uh, before yourself. And, you know, always remember that, you know, your life is still going to, your life is still good. God is still good and God will always be good. And you're going to, you know, whether you're trying to get to a destination or whether you're just trying to get through your work day. You're gonna make it to the end of your work day peaceful and sound, even if you have some interruptions, so you have some setbacks, some moments of, end of, of frustration today. I just encourage you to get back up, keep moving forward, keep praising God, keep trusting God, keep worshiping God. Don't allow don't allow yourself to stay in, in that in that moment of complaining. Don't allow yourself to stay in that moment of frustration or agitation. Don't allow it to because God has been so good to us. You know, so I know we, I know we honestly say God has been too good to us, but God has been so good to us that we have no reason to complain. So, you know, 